This morning, we're shining the sunrise spotlight on the wife of longtime NFL star and Portland product, Indomitian Sue, who's making a name for herself here in the city with a brand new bar that just opened up in the Alberta district. Yeah, so cool. Digital reporter Sabina Pierre takes us to Kaya. Sort of kicks and cocktails with me, Katya Sue. It's hard to give just one title to Katya Sue. You're on your way somewhere and your gas light turns on. <clears throat> Girl math says you got 31 miles on your gas tank. <laughs> GPS says you got seven more miles to go. I don't need to stop nowhere. What you mean I can get to and from it? I'm fine. We are fine. To her social media followers, she's known as a mother of two. To Portlanders, she's now making a name for herself in a new way. Bringing really fun, elevated cocktails and bar food together to bring our community together. Katya is now the founder and owner of Northeast Portland's newest bar, Kaya. And it all started as a hobby. After giving birth to her twin boys, Katya Sue combined two of her many passions, cocktails and sneakers, into her YouTube show, Kicks and Cocktails. Her passion grew, eventually manifesting into this new bar. That is something that is really, I think, powerful. As women, we are mothers, we are wives, we are partners, we are the caregivers. And for me, this is something that gives back to me and gives back to my soul that I'm able to look and say and show my children this is what I did. From the drinks, food, and the glassware. You're going to have a whole experience when you get them different glassware, different ways it's presented to you. And also we're doing some really fun spin on bar food as well. So it's not going to be just your average bar food. The interior and especially influential artwork Customly crafted by Jordan Barrows, a black artist out of Boston. You know, you got LL Cool J with kangaroo hats. You've got, you know, Jay Z, um, Biggie, Tupac. They've impacted our culture in so many different ways, whether it's um, Tupac with a bandana tie. You see them, they are there, vibrant in their color because we are here, vibrant in our own color. Kyle will be joining Alberta Alley, home to a variety of eateries on Northeast Alberta Street. The alley was founded by Namakin, not too far from his childhood home, centered around community. We want to empower our community, and so this is a space not only here at Kaya, but Alberta Alley as a whole. We've got four amazing concepts from Bay's Fried Chicken, Boxer Ramen, Kinnamans, and now Kaya. I grew up down the street, um, so it's an area that I was born and raised in, uh, and there's been a lot of gentrification that happened, so being able to bring back something uh, and then really letting it be BIPOC owned is, is very important. So uh, bringing our culture into this, and then obviously Jamaican roots, uh, where the name Kaya comes from as well. And though he had no hand in the process, he has one request for his wife. I think I only, my only request was to have a drink named after me at some point in time. So we'll see what she, she creates for that. In Northeast Portland, Sabina Pierre, KGW News.